Welcome back to another video everyone. Today I'm going to be playing Undertale. Now this is a game that I've known about for a long time, though I don't really know anything about it. The only thing I know about it is that the character Sans is from this game. I saw it on Game Pass and I thought, why not check it out while I have the chance? Alright, humans versus monsters. Monsters have been trapped underground. My controller is extremely noisy, so not the best for this game, but uh, oh well. Alright, let's make our way over here. Howdy, I'm Flowey. Flowey the flower. Hmm, you're new to the underground. Right, little tutorial, I guess. Okay, so that's love. Get as many as we can. That didn't work. You idiot. Well, that took a turn for it. That, I did, that was like the last thing I was expecting for that little flowery the flower to turn into a fucking demon telling me to die. I think these are like save points and HP restore points. Achievement for doing nothing, I'll accept it. Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. The ruins are full of puzzles. Ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labelled the ones that you need to flip. I wonder if this is the one I need to click. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. You earned zero XP and zero gold. Oh, is it like a random encounter thing where you don't get to see the enemies? Alright, let's talk to this, uh, Froggit. Compliment check threat. I'm gonna compliment Froggit. Didn't understand me, but I tried at least. So I've got to wait here? I don't think so. I think I'll go explore. Oh. So I don't know if that is genuinely telling me to go back and wait here, or if I can go ahead. I'm just gonna do it anyway. What's this? It says take one. Take a piece of candy? Doesn't seem very safe to be honest with you, but... Free piece of candy. Heals 10 HP. Has a distinct non licorice flavour. Oh, I see. You won. Oh, insta kill. I'll take it. Okay, is that good or bad? Well, there I am, so yeah, that was good. Ring. Hello, this is tor tor Tutorial. For no reason in particular, which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? Cinnamon. Oh, I see. Thank you very much. Please don't step on the leaves. Why not? Oh, two enemies. Okay. We're going to uh, win some first. Because I can probably kill it instantly, like that. And we gotta find, like, the correct path that doesn't drop. Is that what this is about? My HP is actually kind of low. I'm gonna use my item. 
Really? Is there any way to get through there? Okay, there is a way to get through. We'll get there eventually. Really? I kind of want to move forward, but I want to go and read that sign. Didn't you read the sign downstairs? There's my answer. Talking rock. Nope, wrong way. Thank you. Hey, you little shit. Oh, I need this desperately. Not to brag, but I'm level two. Right, so let's take this cheese. Oh, it's stuck to the table, never mind. Sleeping enemy? Move it with force. Mm, we'll just click no for now, see what that does. Oh, nothing. Okay, guess it's force. I'm gonna act this time. Flirt. Uh, no, thank you. Uh, we'll go on uh, cheer. Oh, you're still gonna attack me? That's rude. This time we're fighting. Perfect. Oh god. Oh, what? how am I meant to dodge that? I need some perfect shots to end this thing quickly. Do you know you can't kill ghosts, right? That's what I was thinking. I was just lowering my HP because I didn't want to be rude. Pretend you beat me. Ooh. Right, so which way do we go? Okay, that's down there. What's through here? Uh, this room's small, so we'll go through here first. Spider bake sale. All proceeds go to real spiders. I'll leave some in this web because it's... I mean, I'm kind of broke right now, so... Yay. There was just one switch. Okay, so I think we've got to fall down every one of the holes. Oh, I thought that was an item. Vegetoid came out of the earth. Oh, I've not got much HP. Do I have that donut? Thankfully, that did what I was hoping it would do. Oh, these things are kind of strong. Wait, so I can just go through this one, right? And then activate the switch. Yeah, but I'm gonna go through them all anyway, just to see what else there is. Nothing. In fact, no, there's nothing in any of them apart from this last one, where there's another Vegetoid. And I'm gonna kill it for the XP. The far door is not an exit, it simply marks a rotation in perspective. Wait, so I didn't need to activate any switches? What does it do, though? Nothing happened. Nothing happened on any of them. Alright, let's keep going then. Hmm. So I keep getting teleported back here. Yeah. Oh. Green switch. Where is the green switch in here? I'm gonna assume this is it. There are two different ways. I'm just gonna go through here first. Wait, that leads us somewhere else. New weapon. You found the toy knife. Toy knife. Weapon attack three. Made of plastic. A rarity nowadays. What's my current weapon attack? Oh, attack four. So is that like... I think that's worse than my stick. I'll keep going. Oh dear. That took longer than I thought it would. How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? I should not have left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try and surprise you like this. Do you smell that? Snail pie? Yeah. I'd rather not eat that right now. My room! Cool. You found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Sounds better than snail pie or whatever it was. An empty photo frame. It's really dusty. A box of kid shoes in... Wait, what? In a disparity of sizes, why are there so many? When can I go home? Nothing. Kind of like it here, to be honest. What's up here? No, I wanted to eat it. All right, I guess it's time to go downstairs. Oh, the, the music's gone off. This doesn't... I think you should play upstairs instead. Hmm, I don't know. I'm getting kind of... Like, obviously it's a friendly character, but that just gave me some, uh, evil vibes, I'm not gonna lie. Is this dangerous to play here? Come back. Right, what am I meant to do, though? I don't understand. Right, let's just... So we were meant to click on that. Let's go, let's try going back down now that 
Toriel's gun. Ah, that's... You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I'm going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. Right, I'm definitely not getting friendly vibes from this character anymore. I ain't going upstairs. I think this is going to be our first boss battle or something. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I've seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You naive child. If you leave the ruins, they will kill you. As cool. I can't tell if it's a if he's actually trying to protect me or not. Final warning. What are you going to do if I keep going? It is the first boss fight, but more of a friendly boss fight. Oh, that's a lot of HP. And that is hard to dodge, so I'm probably not going to win this one. But then again, I do have more options than just fighting, which would probably be wise, because I ain't going to get anywhere like this. How are you meant to dodge that? I don't think you can win this fight. I think that's the whole point. So he's going to kill me on this attack. Well, probably the next one. So I think we're meant to lose this boss battle. Or maybe I'm just crap. I managed to get half his health down at least. I got really lucky there though, so I can keep going. Yeah. Wait, why are the why is his attacks getting like very weak? I mean that was super easy to dodge. They're put. Okay. They're not. I can just stand still, they're not gonna hit me. I kinda feel bad. Do not let Asgore take your soul. I didn't just kill this character, did I? No! Why'd you have to die? You asked me to battle you, I didn't think I'd be killing you when I did that. I thought it was just gonna be like, you know, if you beat me, I'll let you go, and then I'll return home. I feel awful now. That character was friendly all along. Oh, not this flowery the flower again. I hope you like your choice. After all, it's not as if you can go back and change fate. That old hag thought she could break the rules. Oh, it was a she, my bad. She tried so hard to save you humans, but when it came down to it, she couldn't even sue for herself. What an idiot. Can I kill you instead, please? Wait, so did I have the option to not kill that character? Because if I did, I probably would have preferred to have not done that. This is scary. What was that? Are my eyes playing tricks on me? Was that a tree? Or did I just see something? Oh, I saw something. Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. Oh, is that Sans? The old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. It's always funny. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans the skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now, but, you know, I don't really care about capturing anyone. His dialogue kind of reminds me, it kind of sounds like Patrick Star. Just take a look behind the damn lamp already. Love all the skeleton puns. 30 gamer score. Wow, this game gives you a lot of gamer score. It's some sort of checkpoint or sentry station, but there are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. Right, well, I'm gonna end off the video here for episode one. I think I'll continue this if, you know, people want to see more videos. If not, I'll just play it off camera, but I'll wait until I've posted the video to see whether or not I should record the next part. But I'm enjoying it so far. I can imagine the puzzles and everything are going to get 
tougher as we go on. And I'm happy that I ended off the video at Sands. The only thing that I knew about this game before going into it. But yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Definitely subscribe if you're new here and I'll see you all in my next video.